What's up, YouTube, and welcome back to The Escapists. Um, last episode, we had beaten Center Perks, and we're going to be starting a brand new prison. So, Center Perks is now officially done. We are now in Staglag Flucht. I don't even know if I'm saying that right. It's probably something to do with, like, uh, Russia or something like that. Um, it's also an easy prison. We're going to continue. We're going to go back to my, uh, my bald guy. Gotta name him. Binks. And, uh, I think we're going to have some fun with, uh, this one. We're going to actually name all of these people. So I'm going to name, <clears throat> I'm going to name every inmate just so I can get, a. Uh, a little bit more customization, but there's three old guys. I, I wonder if I could change the way they look, too. Probably not. It's not giving me that, like, option. And we have another bald guy, but we have three old men. Alright. So let's start off with this guy right here. Uh, well, I'm gonna, I'll start with the blonde. I'm gonna name him Chris. There we go. Oh, it didn't save. Chris. Name already in use. Really? So, like... If the name's already in use, I have to... Uh, Officer Chris! Uh, let's see. He's gonna be, uh, Bob for now. Until we figure it out. Officer Bob. Alright, so, Carl, your name is now gonna be Chris. Okay. Uh, Brass. I'm gonna, I'm gonna name this guy Burns. For those who know, my duo partner in Fortnite. Ah, oh, he doesn't keep the capital Z. It's a little disappointing. Alright, Burns. Alright, so we got Chris, we got Burns. Uh... Let's see. You, you look like a Marcus. I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep him Marcus. I, I gotta bring back my boy Steve. Because Steve was one of my old mates. It's already in use. Oh, Steve! Look at him! He's still... He's joining me in this prison. I didn't have to make him. Awesome. All right. Um... Uh, yeah. Okay, so this orange kid. We're gonna... We're gonna name the... Let's see. Reminds me, if you guys ever read the, uh, the comic book Calvin and Hobbes, that's what he reminds me of. So his name's gonna be Calvin. Alright, this, this bald guy. We're gonna name him Daly. For Mr. J. Daly. Joseph Paul. Blank Blanks! Yo, Blanks in the other prison was white with blue hair. He totally changed his thing around. You can't you can't be taking Blanks' name like that. Absolutely not. Uh let's see. What what, what should we name you? Because you cannot be Blanks whatsoever. Um I'm gonna name you I'm gonna name you Jeff. That's what your name. Jeff. All right, so we got Officer Cameron, Rodney, Aiden, Simon, and Bob. Okay, definitely want to. Right, well, let's see. We're gonna want to do for you. We're gonna go Officer Dave. I'm gonna do uh, Officer Scott. Uh, let's see. Officer uh, Officer John. Um, let's see, what are, the, what are the guys' names are there? I'm trying to think of people in my life. What was your name before? Aiden and Roddy. I don't, I don't like either of those names. Um, let's see. Okay, we're gonna go with that Officer Tony. And Rodney, you are going to be, uh, ha, my boy Lyle. Shout out to my boy Lyle in the Vividity Gaming. Officer Lyle, you were the last one. Alright, so we got Burns. Marcus, I left alone. We have Joseph and Paul. Got my man, Steve. Maybe in this prison he'll like me. We got Jeff over here. We got my boy Daly. Got my boy Chris. Got my boy Calvin with the stuffed animal tobs. Then we got Officer Dave, Officer Scott, Officer John, Officer Tony. Officer Lyle. So here we go. New prison. Who am I bunking with? Oh. Set me another one half. Alright, listen, Binks, I don't have time. I don't know. I don't have to remind you that Stalag Fluck 
Fluke, whatever, is famous for housing inmates with a record of escapism. So if you're planning on getting out of this one, think again. Now get yourself settled in. It's going to be a cold, long winter. Warden Patrick Garrett. So I guess the storyline is that you escape Center Perks and you are recaptured and now you're thrown in this one because they need to probably get you in a better secure prison. So in this one, it looks like there's not like an actual cell. I'm bunking with Daly and thank God I have a roommate who freaking likes me. Look at this, 93 opinion. I mean, if we hated each other, that would be bad. But all right, I'm rooming with Daly. That's totally cool with me. What is up? My man has to sell me stuff right off the bat. He's got foil. Ah, oh, this is going to be a good series already. This is going to be fun. I only have 10 bucks. I don't, I don't, do I have the same gardening? That is my job. I have no idea how to garden. This is going to be interesting. So can I like rummage through Daly's desk? I am totally am. He's got a crafting note. He's got a file. Yo, he's the plug right off the bat. All right, let's go. This looks like roll call over here. Let's do the craft, cla crafting mo the crafting note. Work key mode. Mo yeah, I know how to do that. But we have a, uh, we have a file right off the bat. That's nice. All right, who are the shakedowns? Let's go. Steven Burns. Ooh. My man Burnsy over here. Where's where's Burns? Oh, my man Steve likes me. Dude, he likes me. Deliveries is his job. Oh. My, my man Chris over here. Let's see. Let's see. Jeff Daly. Yeah, I know Daly. Burnsy. My, oh, my boo Burns. Ooh. Lisa the... At least I have... All of them pretty much like me. My boy John, though. Definitely the best out of all of them. All right. Uh, my lucky pack, playing cards, found its way, and palm, get it back. It means I have to beat up my man Steve. You know what? Listen, Steve, I tried so hard in last uh, prison to get Steve to like me, and he just didn't. So you know what? In this prison, I'm going to kick his ass. You are my new Ricky, Steve. Uh, Calvin Block. All right, so let me get this straight. Calvin wants me to beat you up, and... Beat up Calvin for Steve, and Calvin wants me to get your playing cards. So I technically don't have to, you know, beat you up. I, I don't know any of the layout for this, um... It was, let's see if the, the playing cards are actually in here. They're not. Ooh, playing cards, yeah. Right? Calvin from Steve, and that was Steve's desk. Unless he's thinking about a different playing card. Wow, that's a... Alright. Uh, where's Calvin? There he is, I gotta remember. Oh, my man Calvin's sitting all alone. It's probably because you hang out with uh, with Hobbs, right? Cool. I guess that wasn't your playing cards. All right. Let's see what Marcus has to sell. Oh, and a crafting note. Can't buy it. I have no money. I don't know why I'm looking at any of these. Uh, let's see what Paul... I need a service medal. Oh, whatever that is. Sure. Steve... Daily seems to be drawn to the inside of my desk. Introduce him to your fist. No, I will not, because Daily is my boy. You being trolled? Oh, I'm sorry, John. You the man. No, you the man, Daily. Oh, look at my man Daily and Chris sitting next to each other. That would happen in real life, to be honest with you. Uh, so now my job... Ooh, I gotta put my file away. I almost just went... Where's my desk? Where's my... Well, where's my cell? Jeff, Steve, Daly... Okay. Let's go into my desk. So there's, it's like a straight up door, so there's no need to put sheets on. How do I get, where do I go? Gardening tools, okay. Um, a hoe? What, what the hell do I do? I, do, I don't know, what do I do? I'm gonna get fired from my job on, oh! Weeding, so I guess I'm looking for weeds around the property here. How? Here's my thing. It's snowing out. How in God's name are weeds growing in the snow? That's what I need to know. This is going to take a lot longer than... Ooh. That's like a double, two for one. All right, job. I can only get $15 for that. What a ripoff. Oh my god, I'm gonna put this hole back because I don't I just don't wanna have it on me. Gardening tools, let's put this back. So my man Burns is doing timber stuff. My man Paul looks like I don't know, fabric. I don't, I don't know what any of that is. Let's see, what, what's what's everyone's job? So I'm gardening. Paul is a tailor. 
Marcus is a lot is in the library. Ooh, the library sounds like it's a good job. May have to jump Marcus and get him fired so I can take that. Deliveries is Steve and the wood shop is Burns. We may uh I don't know how I feel about gardening. They're only giving me fifteen dollars. But uh alright. Uh I still need to find that uh, I need to look for metal, I need to look for let me just check his desk. Maybe he put the cars back in there. He did not. Alright, we're looking for a service medal, though. A little unsure on how... I need to go on a desk, actually. I'm, I'm jumping ahead of myself here. So let's... So there's no vents. Like, how the hell... Oh, I'm sorry. I gotta remember, I can... There's two desks in each. Alright, so I'll take the duct tape. I don't need... I'm not gonna take... Right, so this is, right, let's see if my man John, or Daly, has anything new in his desk. He does not. So I would have to, here's my thing, now hear me out. If there's no place to put anything in like, I, I'm going to leave this pause for, pause for a second. There, I'm going to take the pocket watch. I'm, I guarantee someone asked for that at some point. Um, if there's no place to go to the vents. I mean, you have to probably store your stuff underground, which means you have to dig. Now, hear me out. If your roommate catches you with a hole and ch catching you escape, are they going to rat you out? Like, I don't know. This is an e it's supposed to be an easy prison. Family photo. Hmm. I'll take the super glue, though. Not that I probably need it. I don't, why would I need paper mache? I mean, it's not like I need a fake vent cover or something like that. I don't know. We'll see. I need to figure out where everything is. This is a big prison. So, train jogging or push-ups. Oh, so it's not weights. We're just straight up doing push-ups in this one, in this gym. Yo, did my man Daly just get knocked out? Oh, who, Steve? Did you just knock out my man Daly? Oh, my God. Oh, Daly, you got another file, man. You are just... I don't want to have heat, though. And I really don't want to take that much contraband yet until I can figure out exactly where I'm going to store it, to be honest with you. I don't know. Free period. So we're not we're not taking a shower after. No. Was there no lunch served? I just realized that it was breakfast and then. Okay. So this is the shower. It looks like. All right. Payphone. You want to escape, kid? You well, you phone the right person. We'll give you some tips, but it's gonna cost you. So for fifteen dollars, I can unlock. All right, let's do uh, the twenty-five dollar one. You'll have to befriend your cellmate if you don't want him snitching on you. Well, uh, see, and I asked that question, and I received the answer. Ask and you shall receive. So you, we need, me and Daly need to be freaking tight. All right, let's befriend you. So okay, so if Daly ends up hate, hating me. We're gonna oh, find me a pocket watch. I'll make you work. Yeah, there it is. Boom. I'm gonna give you the pocket watch. I told you someone's definitely gonna ask that. Where's my boy John? Babe, burn day. Let me do my thing. Fuck you. That's probably what you would really say to me in real life. All right. Um. You want to escape? All right. So fifteen dollars will unlock this one. If you have several favors where you need to return items to inmates, easiest way to do is that roll call. That actually probably is the smartest thing to do. Wow. Okay. I never thought about that. 35 for the last one. All right. So that's where you you smell nice. Thank you, Calvin. Me and Calvin are becoming boys. Yo, my man Chris. Marcus had had his crew on the outside to harass my, I, I need him out later on the floor. How about it? You know what, Chris? I got you. I'll knock him out. My man Steve. What, what? There's so many things going on. It's all cracking off. No. Fuck you, Steve. And I apologize. I, I do want to stop cursing on this channel. All right, what's this? This looks like uh, the infirmary. Yeah. We need to get the, the scopes here. So we have a lot bookshelf. This is probably where you learn intellect. Yep. Okay. All right. So it looks like a double fence. Yeah. Scope this out a little bit. There's the kitchen. That looks like solitary. Yep. So I the easiest way looks like coming out of here, but that looks like another fence right there. Looks like it's double fenced all around. Right, we're gonna continue looking through some desks during our free period. Doesn't look like there's lunch, which is actually pretty cool. This means there's more time that I can just straight up do things. 
That's Burns. I heard Chris's wife got arrested. Oh, no. I've always said that. Oh, oof. I need to borrow chocolate. Can you hook me up? I got you, buddy. I'm running out of favors, though. Right. Burns his desk. Let me go through his, uh, his stuff. He's got nothing. A plunger, 100%. I wonder what you can do with a plunger, to be honest with you. Foil, I'll take that. I'm gonna take the soap. I need a sock. Does it burn? Do you have any socks? No. Did I get scotch tape? I think I did get scotch tape, right? I did not scotch tape, duct tape. I did, all right. Um, I think I could take a book. I don't know if I have the intellect for it though. I think it's like, all right, so here, I take that book and scotch t uh, the duct tape of booking need 33 more intellect all right we gotta get our learn on here let's put my stuff back in book i need a sock daily do you have any socks man no evening meal time all right Hey, you can't take any more favors. I'm sorry, Chris. All right, so I need to beat up Calvin still. Oh, me and Calvin are getting close, man. I'm not, nah. It's for, it's for Steve now. Steve is my new Ricky. Oh, Marcus is down. Crafting note, thank you. A sail. Timber bed sheet requires, why would I need a sail? I mean, that's maybe for future, uh, I'm gonna talk to my boy John, get his, keep his, gotta keep this up, man. What are you selling? A sheet of metal, a baton, a hammer. And rope, nothing I could really use right now. Chris, I want to like knock you out. I plan to teach someone a lesson during the next morning roll call. Get the guard's attention. I'm gonna do a maybe because I don't want to say no to lose my opinion. You're not friends with Marcus, are you? All right, yeah, I'll kick Marcus's ass. Do I have to beat up Marcus? I have to beat up Marcus for Chris and Burn. So that's Marcus looks like he's gonna be going down. That's Marcus right there. I gotta remember the Afro looking guy. What else do I need to do? I need. To, I still need to beat up Steve too. Where is he? But I don't have a weapon. I need. I'm all over the place. I need a. Uh, I need a weapon. I definitely need more strength. Oh, Daly and Steve going at it. Wait, gardening again. Do my job twice. Daly, I'll take the lighter from you, John. I hope that doesn't ruin our friendship a little bit. There's. Oh, okay, I don't have to beat up his Steve anymore because there's the playing cards. Thank you, and I'm gonna take the file with me, and you're using a pillow as your weapon. That's your first mistake right there, Steve. Alright, need to deposit my stuff. Nope, that's not my cell. Here, right here. Okay, so let's put everything in here. I do have soap, I don't, so I don't need soap. Where's, where's John? Ah, I'll do it later. Give John a bar of soap. Gotta keep him on my good side. All right. Grab the hoe. There he is, my man John. Here's a nice bar of soap, buddy. All right. Looking for weeds. Looking for weeds. Looking for weeds. So I'm getting paid fifteen dollars. It's thirty dollars a day in two different segments. I don't know how I feel about that, to be honest with you. And I feel like this is way too much pressure because, like, I have to actually find the weeds. I feel like it's easier if I had like a uh, a job where everything's like with me. Maybe something to think about in the future, like knocking out one of them or something like that. Have them get fired. Because like, I'm running out of time here. I need to find more weeds. I wouldn't mind being like the delivery person because I would have to go, I would be allowed in everyone's cell. Sock mace, that's what I wanted. Thank you. And now I have a weapon. My man John. Hey, buddy. 86. Our opinion keeps dropping. What are you selling, though? I feel like I already looked at this. Scotch tape. Uh, I keep calling it scotch tape. Duct tape. Oh, wow. That's a big pay increase. Maybe it's more? I had, what, $7? Or so? I don't know. Uh, I could always use you always use duct tape. So I'm gonna buy that off of you. I'm gonna put the mop back. 
Ooh, almost went through that with the duct tape. Ooh. This place is garbage, yeah. You said it, Chris. All right, let's put the duct tape over there. And we're gonna put the, the hoe back. I low key want Burns' job. <laughs> you just go back and forth. Maybe one day. So the shower block, I was gonna say, when are we gonna take a shower? Oh, before, oh, $24, wait. Oh, I bought, okay, yeah, I bought, um, duct tape. Oh, who's fighting? Daly and Steve, yo, Daly and Steve are just, they're not having it, man. My man Daly. A dog tag, Daly, ooh. All right, let's see. Steve, what do you have? 28, I don't have enough. Chris, what do you, uh, I plan to teach? Now I'm gonna say maybe. Steve's been snitching me out to the guards. Yeah, I'll beat him up. I need, still need to beat up Marcus. Where is he? There he is, Afro. Gotta remember Afro. Let's see. Strength, you're stronger than me and you're faster than me, but you don't have a weapon. Maybe, uh, maybe I need to lift some more weights before I beat you up, Marcus. Evening roll call. All right. Ooh, that's shining right in my eyes, man. I need to actually be careful. Because, like, there's nowhere to hide my contraband right now. But I'm not getting the shakedown. But, like, if Daily gets a shakedown, do I get the shakedown? Like, does it go... Or they, do they just look at Daily's desks? Or, like, do I... I don't know. I don't know. Just keep saying hi, yep. Wow, they watch you go in. Wow, okay. Let's see if John put anything else in his desk. Oh, I'm sorry. No, no, John, I'm sorry. I don't mean to pe beat you up. God. Ah, oh, that means we have to fight. Oh, I just knocked you out, buddy. I'm going to take your dog tag now. Here, can I put you back in bed? Oh, no, I just stole your bed sheets. I'm sorry. Oh my god, okay, so note to self, do not look through Daly's desk when Daly is in the room. Alright, uh, yeah, I think that's, we're gonna, we're gonna end that episode there. We learned a lot today, we need to figure out what we want to do, how we're gonna escape. I'm thinking, off the top of my head, I'm thinking we're just gonna make a long ass tunnel to, to the end over there, right? That's, that's the best way I, I can see us, like, getting out. Is just digging underneath our desk until we get all the way past. But uh, remember to leave a like, comment, and subscribe. Um, until next time, guys. Peace out.